Hey, what's up, Stavi? Big fan. Um, I don't have any dude perspective in my life to ask. You're the only dude I know off the top here, of my here head. Here we are. I've got a couple um, of I've been living with my boyfriend me. for like two and a half years, about to be three years. And he randomly sat me down the other day and told me that his little brother, who is 12, we're in our mid-20s, his youngest brother, who's 12, doesn't have a male father figure in his life and is being raised by their grandma. And he told me he wants to move in with his grandma and his brother to be a father figure to him, Um, which is all fine and good, but we live 20 minutes away from his grandma. Like, how is he going to be more there for him (laughs) 20 minutes away or living with him as opposed to where we live now? It's a whole city over. It's that. Um, I don't know. What do you think? It sounds real noble, but he's leaving me high and dry to pay our rent. (laughs) So now I have to figure it out because he's going to be there for his brother, who already comes over all the time. (laughs) We have a spare room for him, so what's the difference? Oh, wow. I don't know. You think I think he's just making an excuse and trying to tiptoe his way out of I here. I think you're probably yeah, right. Think. Yeah. Uh, thanks, bud. <laughs> you don't need dude advice. You got yeah. It. You, you you don't need us. You're a genius, baby. Yeah. Uh, yeah. That this this stinks to me of. Yeah. How is this bitch gonna fucking mm-hmm. con? How's she gonna? How's she gonna hit me with the Uno reverse on this? Right. There's no counter right. to this. If we can think of a, a hero's selfless. way out of yeah. a relationship, this is a hero's way out it. of a relationship. We're gonna try it, and it's 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 three months later. It's like ah, I just I can't be. I, yeah. He's my sole focus right now. Meanwhile, you break up. He's on Tinder. You know what I mean? Like right. you're. I think you're right. I think twenty twenty minutes away. The thing is, she doesn't even. This is this our caller here is actually like a great person who's like I thought she was gonna be like look I just have yeah. a problem with this kid being around all the time it's like I want to date him I didn't sign up to date somebody who has a kid right like and you yeah. know what you'd be I think you'd be within your rights if you're in your mid twenties right. and somebody just in the middle of a relationship says hey you're sort of gonna become a stepmom now right right you would be well within your rights to be like. Nah. This ain't for me. Yeah. But she's not even doing that. She's saying, we got a fucking room for him. The kid can crash here half the week. What's th- And he's only 20 minutes away. And unfortunately, this feels like open and shut. You read it completely correct. Yeah. There's there's no other read for me here. You know when the uh, like Ukrainian war started and guys would like, <laughs> go over there to fight in the yeah, war? Like, yeah, how yeah. many of them were just leaving their wives? Yeah. <laughs> I gotta go save these <laughs> lives. I really give a fuck yeah. about you. A place I, I knew it. about two weeks it ago. It sounds really bad over there. Yeah, it sounds. You I'll know, be back, honey. I you swear. know how much I've always hated yeah. Putin. <laughs> ah, I really hate him. Ah, you should. Yeah. so fucking funny. How many of those guys? Absolutely. Um, so yeah, I think, I think I this think is great. Right. And at the very least, even if. Even if he's not trying to tiptoe his way out of here, it's incredibly. In, even if he has pure, like, um, if he has like pure intentions here, yeah. it's insanely inconsiderate to leave you high and dry. It is f- with the rent. Like, what's he gonna do? L- move in there, but still crash at your place three nights a week? Yeah, that's fucking crazy. At the at best case scenario, he's being inconsiderate and trying yeah. to take advantage of you financially because yeah. I don't yeah. see it. He's not, if you guys keep dating, it's not like he's not going to come over to your house. So how long has she, how long have they been together? Did she say? Uh, I don't think she said, but you know, if they're living to, together, no, no, he, I've been with living with, my bo- living oh, with oh. him for two and a half years, about to be three oh, years. Wow. Yeah, this is crazy. And I think, I think you, if I were you, I would just, I would have, you would, you seem very emotionally intelligent and just like aware of things. And also yeah. she's a pretty straight shooter. I think you should, you should kind of, he sat you down out of the blue. You got to sit him down out, out right. of the blue and be like, Hey, this, this feels very sudden. It's unfair to me financially. It's not like we just moved in together. They've been together for right. fucking a long time. They've been mo- living together for three years, probably together at least a little bit before that. Right. I, I get what you're trying to do here, but I need are you I need you to be honest with me. Are yeah. you trying to like 
are are you are you committed here? Because if this is just step one of you getting out of this relationship, right. I would rather we break up now and I can right. move on with my life. This may be a just, good thing for you. You're mid twenties. Yeah. To find out that he's not considerate enough to think for about sure. your position, or to find out that he just wants out is totally is good news because you're so young. That's a good point. And so this is also around the time where it's like the this is the kind of relationship where it's like you're around the point where it's like. You're young enough to move on, but it's also like, if this is serious, let's let's commit. Right. Because you know you're also not 22, right? Like, Mid 20s, still pretty hot. Mid 20s is yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Mid 20s is still. Don't get me wrong. Mid-20s We're fucking young. I'm 35. I get it, but I'm just saying like, um, yeah. This also is the time in the relationship where it's like, you should know for yourself. And yeah, maybe this is just enough information for you to be like. I don't really want to be with the kind of guy who just That's out right. of the blue sticks me with That's right. this rent and thinks he could just go back and just takes me emotionally right. for granted this much. Yeah. So, because you're right, 20 minutes and you being open to being part of his life. Right. He's just going to make big decisions and not take you into account. Exactly, exactly. Forever. He didn't, he didn't broach this like, hey, what do you think of right. this? Could you afford this? Would I be... Right. Like, I feel like I've been more considerate to roommates when I moved out. Yeah. <laughs> like, hey, guys, if... It, like, can you afford it if I left? Like, I've literally had those conversations in and the you past. throw cash in their face? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, not now. Now I'm like, get the fuck out, you fucking <laughs> yeah, poppers. Yeah, yeah. Everyone's evicted. I'm turning it into a podcast studio. I changed the locks. 